Okay, guys, just a quick trick that I learned on one of my trips last week. I um, was headed up, I was in Tennessee at the TKO trails, and I probably showed you a video where I flipped over and I punctured my hydration bladder here. If you can just see that little dab of glue I stuck on there. What happened is I was going up a steep incline, caught a rock, flipped down the hill, caught some saplings, saved my butt, landed on my back. I actually had a can of mace in here which I carry for bears and what have you if I'm deep out there by myself. And the can, I shouldn't have put the anything in with this thing because if you fall on it, it, just a little tiny corner on the handle punctured this with a pinhole. So what I did was um, it was leaking down the crack of my ass, which felt kind of nice on a hot day, but um, I was going to lose all my water and I was out there pretty deep and I was boiling. So um, I flipped it upside down because the hole was low, as you can see, now it's high. And then I told you I just had to like, it didn't leak out the top, which was nice. So that stopped the leak temporarily. So when I got back, couldn't figure out what to patch it with. I tried some duct tape, it did, did, didn't work. So I went to the local uh, Ace hardware store and I searched all the glues. And this is one I found that worked. So you can check it out. Pretty easy to see the label here. It says it stays flexible. So what I did out in the field there, because I was in the middle of nowhere, I didn't have a ton of tools. So I basically, I do always carry rubbing alcohol because I like it for cleaning motorcycle parts and stuff like jets and things. So what I did was I cleaned it with the rubbing alcohol real well and scrubbed it good. I always use this 90 stuff. I tried to just buy it at Walmart's cheap. And then I actually just grabbed a stone on the ground and used that as my sandpaper. So I sanded around in circles around my pinprick there. And then I just put a dab of this stuff on and it worked great actually. So there's a little trick for you. Yeah, I know it, it's a pin prick. You guys are wondering, hey, is this like toxic? I don't know. I'm sure the plastic bag's toxic, so I'm not worried about it. Anyway, um, it dried up. It says 16 to 24 hours or something like that. It was good. I didn't use it the next day, so I was perfect. Uh, put, it, uh, put the water in there. I pressure tested it with some air actually. Uh, blew into it and then I uh, put the water in the next day I had no leak so there's your quick fix guys if you're out on the trail and these ace hardware stores are all over the place and you can probably find this clear this uh, clear glue here this devcon I uh, hope that helps you guys uh, quick fix on your uh, hydration bladder hopefully that it'll hold you can see it's got kind of little bubbles in there or whatever I was going to go over it with another layer because it kind of pimpled where my hole was but it seems to be working so I ain't going to mess with it talk to you guys later hope that helps take care appreciate any likes and subscribes I'm headed out to ride uh, some sandy trails here in Florida back in Florida so boring compared to Tennessee talk to you later